off with the colors They kinda tell me what I'm thinking I fell in love with the way we are And the way we lose it There's something different about us And the reason why we stay Hi friends Welcome to another day I am I've been working all my It's probably like noon Is it 12 o'clock Jace? I can't I don't know what time it is Yep, it is 12 o'clock. He went on a hike this morning with a friend and maybe we'll insert whatever he footage she got there um, as we get ready to head to Costco. But we are on load four of six in laundry. Um, I'm not sure how I got behind. I didn't do laundry on Saturday because I felt like I was caught up and now all of a sudden there's six loads. That's life with children. Let me show you the little ambiance I've got going on, despite the chores that we're doing. Today is Labor Day. Don't have any major plans, but maybe we'll do something fun with the kids later. Let me show you the little thing I've got here. So despite the dirty dishes that the children haven't done, I have my little um, foliage now. I don't have any f hydrangeas have uh, withered out and I did not um, get a chance to save them by dunking them in water. But this is why I wanted to get this stuff because I think it'll like dry and like stay nice for quite a while. Um, and it looks really, really pretty. So I've kind of shoved some of them out of the way so that I could light this little candle here. Just a little ambiance. It's cold. I am freezing cold. I can't see my goosebumps, but I'm freezing cold. I should not have worn shorts, <laughs> but I don't know. I haven't, I can't quite get to the point where I'm wearing pants yet because it's going to be like 75 degrees ish the rest of the week um despite the fact that it's been raining all night long and 60 degrees outside Ooh, there's a wind chill shoot if it's windy and 60 i think i might actually need to i'm cold now and i can't imagine going into costco into the cold sections which is the only three major areas that we need to go to we need to go into the fruit and veggie section the milk section and the frozen aisle <laughs> the frozen fridge aisle Oh, I need to like second guess. I have, I'm so cold. Why is my arm like, oh, it's just goosebumps. So it looks like it has like red marks. I think that's just from leaning against the desk. Um, but anyway, I, I'm, I'm cold. I'm gonna go get a sweatshirt on. My one jacket, my new jacket is in the wash. So I'm gonna have to just pull out a regular sweatshirt um, and see how they fit. That'll be actually the first time I'm wearing one of my old sweatshirts. And I think it'll just fit nice versus like tight, which will be kind of fun. Right, made it to the top, Snoqualmie, good friend Paul here. Mm. <laughs> we uh, not much to see, pretty cloudy. Maybe it'll break here, if it does, I'll show it to you. Uh, either way, good, good fun hike. Uh, Labor Day, Labor Day, right? Labor Day, so we're enjoying our Labor Day. Hope you are too. Wish that I could stay in this moment forever. And this is when you know Google has lied. What? The internet is not correct? <laughs> it's either that or the apocalypse. Fake news! Fake news. No, this is alternative reality. This is a conspiracy theory. Why is Costco closed on Labor Day? Oh, space lasers. Well, I'll be coming to Costco by myself tomorrow. <laughs> So what? <laughs> Luckily, we just need. Oh, we have donation in the back. We can take. You put it in the car. Yeah. I don't think they're gonna be open today. Oh, that's a good point. All right. Well, we'll go try that. Well, this is an ultimate fail. <laughs> Luckily, we still have milk and bread, and Nutella. That's all they need for another that's twenty-four all hours. Been eating. <laughs> we got them. Sir, they have plenty of food. It's all they eat. Chelsea, I don't think I've seen her eat anything other than Nutella toast. <laughs> she does. You just only see her coming down for a snack. She puts enough Nutella on it to like... But, like we need to powder. discuss something. Something that Jason just discovered and still doesn't understand. And it's Jeeps and Ducks. And Patty, I am so sorry. Who that, knows like, about... He doesn't understand. Duck Jeep or Jeep Ducks. He doesn't what? understand. He's never heard of this before. I've never heard. I like off-roading. I had trucks most of my life. I like the off-roading. I would love to have a tricked out Jeep and go Jeeping or off-roading is what we always call it before buy-in. But I've never heard of this ducks on other Jeep 
He has no idea. So you guys can school him in the comments down below. Yeah, let me know. Because he has no idea what, I need what to know we're talking what the about. Duck this is. <laughs> so this came up because Ashley's teacher at school, she's very young, I will say. So it's perfect for Ashley because I think this generation understands anxiety and depression and therapy a lot better than like even my ther my generation we're getting <laughs> therapy and learning about anxiety but like her generation like went through it hang on let's get up here to the donation place and then i'll talk about life so her teacher is young and has a jeep and has collected enough ducks that almost every kid in her classroom gets their one of her ducks she's numbered them and each of the kid has like a number for their cubicle and their coat hook and you know what I mean like all the areas of the room each kid gets assigned a certain number so they know where to put their stuff and so each duck has a number on the bottom of it and but she doesn't quite have enough ducks and so Ashley's like we need to go and find her duck her jeep and duck her jeep in the parking lot she's like can you do that during school and I said yes go to school and ask her what color her jeep is and I will start collecting ducks to go ahead and duck her Jeep. That's how the conversation started and he has no idea what Jeep ducking is. Never it's just it. a shame. Well, they didn't really turn out like we thought it was gonna turn out. <laughs> Cause this guy has been asleep, asleep since we got home from trying to go to Costco. We did end up going to, yeah, it's almost five. <laughs> We did end up going to just the regular grocery store and getting lemons, grapes, because they were on sale. What else did we get? I can't even remember. Not very many things. Uh, hash browns. Hash browns. For Chelsea. Um, but I have only, I mean, I've taken Ashley to her friend's house, because I was like, well, you might as well have a play date. I've undone her backpack, her cheer backpack, and got healthier snacks put back into it. Um, I've done multiple loads of laundry. <laughs> and I've sat in a parking lot with a cold beverage after I took Ashley just to sit there because I was like, he's not awake. He's been asleep this whole time, hours. Um, so there was no point in coming home. The, I think Kaylee's probably headed to work soon. Actually, she's probably at work. She probably snuck out. Um, without me seeing, but the other two are just relaxing, enjoying their day off of school. And Ashley is at her friend's house doing beads, neck bracelets, as usual. So, and it's cold still outside, cold and rainy. So we have a fun little thing to go and look at, um, on the little trail that I go walk on. I'm gonna go do it tomorrow, so I'll show you guys tomorrow. We were hoping to do it today, but it just keeps raining and it just wouldn't be fun to go do when in the rain. But it is a really fun thing and I'm just gonna make you guys wonder until I go do it tomorrow. I wish I could take the kids tomorrow, but they'll be in school. Um, but I will take them, actually, I'll, I'll take them eventually to go see it. A new little feature in our town um, which is, is kind of cool so I'm gonna go on a walk tomorrow I might go with a friend we'll see if she's up for it tomorrow um, so at this point in the day almost it's 4 30 we kind of have to go back to like school mode like school night mode I didn't realize how long how long you slept oh, I think I'm getting hydrated yeah, probably. I get really dehydrated on Sundays when I'm not like in the mode of drinking water and I have water up. Like I don't hang out at my desk and edit and I'm not in and out of the car and I keep water in both of those places. And so on Sundays when I'm not doing those things and I'm not on the same like eating schedule, schedule then I'm not drinking enough and I get really dehydrated. So that's what I was yesterday. <coughs> I had headache most of the afternoon. Didn't even have a Seahawk game to watch. Oh. Yeah. I know. Sorry. I don't know what to do with myself. <laughs> and... I told Kaylee to take this to... Yeah, I've asked her every day. Yeah. I've asked her every day. I don't want it here. Put it in the garage. Yeah, it's like frustrating. All the food left over for her camp. Um, I'm literally done with laundry. I'm so proud of myself. Got caught up on all the laundry. 
I have nothing left. Well, Jace, will you take this Did up? Did you get that other basket that was up there? The other basket? Yeah. What other basket? Of laundry? Yeah. To wash? Just look at it, yeah. What do you mean? There's an empty laundry basket. You're such a schmuck. <laughs> Here, take this up and that up. That collar's a little bit damp, but it'll dry. Um, done with laundry, which means I don't have to do it tomorrow. And the sun's going to come back out tomorrow. So I'm hoping to just go for a walk. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Here's some more laundry. <laughs> come on. No, 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 don't put it on there. It's too heavy. It's too heavy. Don't want to break it. You're so full of crap. That's what he says to me. I could put it no. back in there, but it's too heavy. I could put it back in there. He knows that I, he, he doesn't I'm want me to. Up. Just, you're gonna go up now because you're gonna put it away for me. I do the laundry and now you go put it away. I know, I just wasn't going up. Oh, rough life. <coughs> I'm listening to a book on my headphones today as I'm in and out of laundry mode. It's, um, what is it, Cabin in the Woods? Cabin it's House in the Woods? Let me find my phone. It's actually pretty good. It took me a long time to get it on my house in the house in the pines. Totally wrong. House in the pines. Little thriller. Haven't quite gotten to the thriller part of it yet. But um, we're just kind of hanging out. Abby's making winter, correct? Lunch, dinner, something. Um, Ashley was asking you if you work today because her and Sadie wanted to go and see you at work. <laughs> I was like, they're not. She's not working today. I'm probably going to get something to eat here now, too. Um, I got nothing for you. <laughs> Sorry. It's been kind of a dead of a night. Dead of a day. We didn't really do anything. Um, Jason took like a four hour nap. I have been in and out of relaxing and watching TV. Kaylee's here though. She's wearing the Knuff sweatshirt. Getting herself a late night snack because she got home from work an hour and a half ago. Yeah. Um, so she's just having dinner. Um, yeah, Jason's been in bed for two and a half hours. He's been in bed for a long time despite his long nap. Um, he had an allergy attack this afternoon before and after his nap, so he is um, ready for bed. Um, small thing, if you want to try and lose weight, don't buy these. <laughs> They're dangerously good. I try and only eat the nine per serving. Nine, nine pieces are one serving. It's really difficult because they're like the size of a dime. <sighs> but I like make sure I keep them hidden too because my kids will eat them in one night. So I am going to say goodnight to you guys. Sorry it was kind of a dead of a day, but just what it is. I'm going to try and go walking tomorrow and I'm going to show you a secret, a new surprise in our town. Um, by I'm just going to, you have to just stick around because it's kind of cool. <laughs> Can't wait to go see it. We've all seen pictures of it, but we haven't gone to see it. So if I have piqued your interest, <laughs> stick around and come see it tomorrow. Take care. Easy, easy on our tiptoes.